With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Well, hello students. Now we're going to see this question. The question says that two mass A and B of 10 kgs and 5 kilograms, okay, respectively are connected with a string passing over a frictionless pulley and fixed at a corner of a table, okay. So the coefficient of static friction between A and the table is 0.2. Minimum mass C that should be placed on A to prevent it from moving is equal to. Okay. So firstly, let's see what is uh, basically over here. There is static friction mu. Okay. And this is the case of the pulley. Okay. So if we draw the FBD diagram over here, means a free body diagram of this, uh, the forces on 5 kilograms basically is nothing but mg. Okay. Which is equal to 5 into 10 which is equal to 50 Newton. Okay, this is simple. And if you see over here, basically, there is only this 10. This is only the tension force. Okay, this is only the force acting over here. So from here, what will happen? Basically, there will be uh, when we put a block C, basically, there will be a normal force also acting on it. Basically, this will be mg and there will be a normal acting upwards. Okay, so what we are going to do now, we are going to just put T equal to mg okay why because tension will be equal to mg because the string is massless so t is equal to mg hence we'll get t will be equal to 50 newton okay so if by 50 newton force it is being pulled okay so what should be the minimum friction okay firstly let's uh, find out what is the friction over here fs max will be equal to 0.2 into something okay means uh, it should be let's suppose uh, n okay and uh, fs max is basically what fs max should be equal to this 50 newtons in order to balance the forces so that uh, over here the fs max which is fs max must be equal to this 50 newton understood why because it uh, it needs to stay stationary okay it uh, we have to prevent it from move from moving so now what we are going to do basically let's write this n properly n okay this is normal force okay don't get confused so we'll just calculate the fs max that is fs max is basically equal to 50 which will be equal to 0 0.2 n okay this is normal force okay 0 0.2 into n this is normal force so i'm uh, deleting all n okay which is newton so that you don't get confused so this is n is basically normal force so now what we're gonna get from here we are gonna get nothing but uh, n will be equal to 50 basically it will be 250 newton okay it will be 50 divided by 0 0.2 which will be equal to 250 newton so i'm not going to put uh, that 2 newton sign because you may get uh, confused with this normal force so that can be very uh, problematic over here so now what we're going to do basically this friction force must be this will be equal to n so n is what n is basically equal to mg over here so let's write over here okay we will have this equation n will be equal to m g okay so m is basically what m is basically this uh, 10 plus mass of c into g got it so now what we are going to do we are going to put this equal to 250 okay so this will be equal to 250 we are going to put this from equation number one let's suppose and we are going to write over here in the bracket from one okay one so now what we're going to do, we are going to just solve it and find out mass of C. So what we'll have over here, we'll have 10 G basically uh, is equal to 10. So 10 plus M C, which is mass of C is equal into 10, which is G will be equal to 250. Okay. So now what we'll do, we'll cancel this 10 with 250 is zero. Okay. So what we're going to be left with, we're going to be left with 10 plus M C will be equal to 25 which will give us mc will be equal to 15 kilograms okay so the minimum value of uh, means the weight of the block must be 15 kilograms so the minimum mass of c must be 15 kilograms in order so that this system remains in equilibrium so our answer will be mass 
of C is equal to 15 kilograms. Got it? Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.